pet? Yeah. Actually, no. This ransomware does not make a good pet. Hence the disclaimer. In the last video, we looked at Satana, an infamous piece of ransomware that not only encrypts your files but also completely destroys your MBR, rendering your system unbootable. But Satana wasn't really the first in its class. Today we'll be looking at a similar kind of ransomware with equally devious design. This ransomware is so deadly and it restarts the system so quickly that I'm not even going to bother with Redshot. As soon as I rename the file to exe, you will notice the naive looking Adobe Reader icon, but don't get fooled by the appearance. This may be 879 kilobytes, but this can destroy gigabytes of data. But before I actually execute it, I would like to show you that this is indeed the culprit on the most wanted list that we're talking about. So we're going to do a quick checkup of the MD5. Just gonna drag it in here. And we'll copy that and check the signature on virus total. A search should reveal it immediately. This ransomware is well known, as you can see, 43 out of 52. And a lot of these detected as Trojan Ransom, but if you look carefully, you can find the keyword. Kaspersky actually calls it Win32 Mikhail, which might be the creator's name. But mostly, it is known by the cute name Petya, if that's how it's even pronounced, because I'm not sure I'm doing it right. But names don't really matter, because uh, you won't be very fond of it. So this time I'm not going to bother with a lot of malware analysis tools because this happens really quickly. So I'll just execute it and let you guys see the show live. For those of you who are not acquainted with these videos, never ever do this on your computer. Don't run malicious files or you will pay the price, quite literally. But I'm not going to bore you guys with any more of the disclaimer stuff. Let's just do it. Now as you can see immediately, our screen resolution is messed up. And I'm seeing a very small screen. Part of the reason I didn't really want to run any other tools. And our system immediately crashes. Now we are seeing CHK DSK, but... After this, it'll just forward through to the scary ransomware page. Trust me, you'll love this one. So our computer just restarted again, and this is what we see. The flashing skull. Reminds me of malware in the good old days. It says press any key, so I will oblige. And now it makes the message clear. You are a victim of Petya ransomware. The hard disks have been encrypted. Now all you can do is enter the key or throw your computer in a bin, smash it against the wall, or you can just format the disks and lose all your data. Unfortunately, that's what happens when you get infected with ransomware like this. Please remember to keep backups of all data that is invaluable to you so that no one can terrorize you with a screen like this. Just saying. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you enjoyed it. Thank you for your excellent feedback on the previous Satana video. I might make this into an entire series if you guys like it so much. Check out my Patreon page, pledge a couple of dollars if you can, and uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the PC Security channel. This is your host, Leo. And as always, stay informed, stay secure.